Hello and welcome to Mind Slayer Monster of Aberrant Spectres. Now, Fanica will give you them once your Slayer is level 60. You have a combat level 65 and the completion of Priest and Peril. Now, if you've done the Slayer Master Mazachana, you will already have it unlocked. But if you don't know where to complete it, it's going to be over here, just uh, east of Varrock. You just follow this path up here and then there's a church, Priest and Peril. You'll do it right there, and you unlocked um, Mauritania. Now, where we're going to be killing him is the Slayer Tower. Just because we're not at the stage of of unlocking Steve, which Steve is over here in Trino Village. Now, you can, if you've unlocked the Spirit Trees teleports, you can possibly kill them within the Slayer Cave. As you see right there, you enter the Slayer Cave. Uh, I think it's right... Where are you enter? Uh, you enter the Slayer Cave, I think, right there. Or no, no, you enter right there. I don't know. Okay, you, this is the Slayer Cave. You enter it, and you can pretty much kill the. I mean, spec. Now, uh, item you will need is a nose peg, which you can buy from any Slayer Master. But I have a Slayer Helm, which works as that. So, I can wear that. As you see, I have a Slayer Helm. I am resistance to their max hit of 14 and it knocks it down to 11 which is really good if you have longer trips in the slayer tower but again if you're killing them at the slayer tower i do recommend nose peg but even in the slayer cave where you can use a cannon i still do recommend a nose peg because you got to go pick up the drops and they could hit pretty hard now their defensive stats they are um, weaker to magic but i think a lot of people just melee them they have 90 hit points so it's best to kill them in the slayer cave but for the purposes of this video we're going to be killing them in the slayer tower so that's pretty much it I, they start dropping a room man a room full helm if you want it uh we got mystic robe bottoms dark if you want that and moving forward from vandica to all the other slayer monster uh masters a lot of your money might be coming from the herbs until you get the Duriel. Duriel is more of a boss type um, Slayer Master but the but going forward all the way to um, right before S Steve you're going to be getting those um, herb in C job so investing in a herb pouch or herb bag I think you might need it so you can, I think you can use your Slayer points to pick it up but that's pretty much it so I'm going to show you how to kill them, how to get there. Again, we're going to be using the Carrial Teleport, which the time of this video, it's going for 1,500 GP, give or take. Not much. I do recommend investing in them, which this will take you right here. Again, you don't need the magic level to do that. You could use uh, the Fair Rings, the uh, Salve Graveyard um, Teleport, or a uh, Frankenstrain. Uh, teleport to his castle. So, hope you, uh, go away. Bye bye. So, I'm gonna share the kill them and we'll be right back.
unfortunately we didn't get any good drops from the killing two of them but that's pretty much okay um, again they drop herbs and seeds that's what these monsters are going to be known for and they do have a lot of HP now again if you have a cannon I do recommend the Slayer Cave which is way easier in my opinion because you can camp it <laughs> and get a lot more kills faster but if not just bring a uh, maybe a full inventory food and you, you do your task pretty fast so hope you guys enjoyed and peace out